Hi there everyone and welcome back to the range here at Dundonald Links in Ayrshire, Scotland. Now, we've been talking through lots of ways that you can improve your technique and hit slightly better golf shots on the course. What I'm going to talk to you about right now is more of a course management kind of thing that you can think about when you next play at your home club. Now, we're all used to watching lots of golf on TV and the length of the golf courses that the guys and girls are playing uh, when we watch the golf on telly is it's just getting longer and longer. So they're very sort of regularly over that 7,000 to 7,500 mark. And certainly that's going to demand of those players that they hit driver and longer clubs a hell of a lot more. Now, I think we get into that mindset of because we see that on TV, we're kind of predisposed to pulling the driver out the bag all the time and hitting it when we're at our local club. Now, it kind of links quite nicely to the video, um, another one in this series that me and Scott were talking about using the kind of shots you have and thinking your way around the golf course a little bit better. But one of the things you should try is hitting slightly less club off some of the tees. Now, sometimes um, the golf courses that we play from week to week and day to day in your local club are nowhere near the length that you find out on the PGA Tour. So we're talking, you know, six and a half thousand to 6,800 yards, most golf courses that you play competitively. So you don't need to hit a driver all the time. And certainly you will find more fairways if you don't. There's more chance of you hitting the fairway with a three wood or a long iron like I've got here than there is hitting driver, just simply because the speed is increased. And if your technique is just as bad. So what I'm saying is if the, if the face is say five degrees open with a three wood, the chances of you hitting, hitting the fairway because of the decrease in speed are, are better. So um, what I'm gonna do is hit a long iron here to show you the sort of swings that we can do to help us hit more fairways. They don't have to be flat out, you know, high power swings. We can just find fairways, hit it, you know, between 170 and 200 yards down some par fours and you'll be absolutely fine. You'll be able to get within range of the green, chip on, maybe make your par, or use your shot, shot slightly better. So I'm just gonna hit one now with a, I've got a, a three iron here. I'm not gonna do a full swing, just nice and smooth, keeping it nice and straight, and hopefully getting this going down the fairway. So yes, I could be hitting a driver um, to get that extra distance, but then comes the kind of percentage play of, maybe if I don't quite get it right, it's gonna go in the trees or in the rough, or there's, we all have a hole at our golf club that we just can't play. Well, let's employ a slightly different tactic next time you play and see if you get on slightly better. So nice and smooth, try and get this ball coming out nice and straight and hopefully find a few more fairways. Alternatively, you could use a three wood. So um, we'll pull that out of the bag as well. That's another club. I absolutely love using this off the tee because it gives me a decent amount of distance, but also, allows me to get away with the odd push or pull shot that you wouldn't get away with with driver. So again, nice and smooth. Let's try and keep it down the middle of that fairway. And again, nice little fade back into the middle there. So try using some different clubs off the tees and see if it helps you score better. 